All right, here's a uh, project I've been working on for a while. It's a uh, seven-segment digital decoder uh, based on uh, single-pole double-throw relays. Nothing fancy. Logic was designed in a program called Logic Friday. This is basically a simplified version of the schematic. Uh, it's a little different now. I added a... Uh, ripple blanking in and out and a couple other functional uh, functional uh, differences from that schematic. Uh, this is the seven segment display um, and then this is the uh, circuit board with uh, all the relays. At the top is some switches that let me set the binary. Right now it's set to zero and if I flip the um, the uh, ripple blanking in uh, and force it on what you'll see is actually the decoded zero. It's hard to tell because uh, it's not really shielded. So, but if you look, all the segments for zero are lit. Uh, let's uh, cycle through some numbers. There's one back to zero because I got toggle switches here. Two, take a look there. Three, turn back off. Let's go to four, five, and then. Six, seven, and then all off except for eight. Now, if ripple blanking uh, in is set, what will happen is when it's zero, oops, I get it back to zero. Oops, that's zero right there. There we go. Uh, that's actually showing binary zero. So for our digital clock or something where you want to suppress zero, uh, if it's zero, that will show up as all segments off. And there's one. It's actually nicer to toggle through it this way because you can see them. You don't go back to zero every time you reset. So there's one, two. We'll just go through the binary. One, two, four, eight. That's about it. There's a, a little closer view of the of the board. Uh, picked up all these relays from eBay. Uh, fairly inexpensive. Uh, the board is uh, it's a pretty good sized board, and uh, with all, I think worst case, with all relays, decoding, whatever, with decimal points, it's about 3 amps, 3 or 4 amps, and uh, that's it. So now, next phase is uh, figure out how to work on the actual counter circuits to drive this. Uh, I might cheat it and, and use a uh, uh, an AVR or pick microprocessor, but it doesn't seem in the spirit of the thing. Anyways, uh, that's the start of this project. There it is.